What was it like getting all these guys together and having them speak your words on screen? I think getting a gang like this together was every bit as much fun as it sounds. I was really humbling, to tell you the truth, to have Jay and, and Terrence and Kurt and guys like Ken Welsh, who is a Canadian film royalty as far as I'm concerned. Yeah, no kidding. And guys like Jason Jones, Chris Diamantopoulos, all of them, all those people over there were just, just so fantastic. And it was humbling because not only did they come on board, but they worked really, really hard under tight deadlines and cold weather and February in, in Ontario. Yeah, it just gelled really well together and it was just a, just a phenomenal experience. And as a writer, it's one thing, but as a director, even more special. You are who? He's my apprentice. So you're a wizard now. In this film, you seem a little out of your element. Your character does anyway, because it's like all new yeah. happening for him. Yeah. And uh, I love the way he deals with it, because he is unintentionally hilarious. Yeah. Uh, what was it like playing this guy? And how much creative freedom did you get as far as your lines were concerned? It was a dream to play this guy. I, I, I love this character. I read him and I got him, I thought, pretty pretty quickly. And you're right, he, he's the last to find out anything. He's the rookie in this world. And and he's just trying to cope. But the whole thing is, it, it, it all stems from his loyalty to uh, to Crunch. And that gave me a sort of, I was saying, easy thing to play, but I always knew what my center was. It's just I have to, I am here as a means of assisting my my hero, my, 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 my guy, my boss. And yeah, no, Jonathan was super open to letting me play around with things, uh, change the wording, maybe find moments that weren't on the page, you know? I think that as long as you keep on message and know what it is you have to do, if you can find an interesting, different way of doing it, I think sometimes it yields some cool stuff. You got the money? Go. Oh. I'm sorry for hitting you with a lead pipe. <laughs> what to you is the one key thing that you're gonna take away from this all, like, years into the future? Personally, it was that I got to work with someone that I feel that like I've, I've, I've come out of this with a, a dear friend and someone hopefully I will be able to collaborate with for years into the future, as well as getting to spend time with these people and to be part of this thing. I'll never forget some of the stuff I learned on this movie, so 100% that's what I take away from it. He stole my answer. That's almost exactly what I was going to say. Do you think I have smugglers in my trunk? <sighs> Please, see all the criminal activity happening in my trunk right now. No!